Well, it's back to school time, the best time to get organized. And I keep hearing about a problem area in the classroom. Paper? How did you know? Why don't I show you some ideas on how to solve the paper, paper problem? problem? The paper problem. Is that an issue in the classroom? There's definitely a paper problem in the classroom. And for me, paper just ends up in piles, and then I've got piles upon piles, so I need help. Well, you're in the right place. I have lots of ideas to stay organized. Okay, this looks like something you plan for the whole week. It is, it's the all-purpose teacher organizer. I have used the five colored bins and I labeled them for one day of the week. I also use the plastic folders and labels that it comes with to organize my lesson plans for the day. So blue, for example, what's blue? Blue's for math. So I can look at this and know every day of the week, math is in the blue folders. And it just helps you stay on top, plan ahead, you're ready to go come Monday. Exactly. So wow, this looks really organized. Thanks, this is my storage cabinet. I have paper trays with lids as well as storage bins. I love these. I use these to stay organized and on top of my paperwork for the entire school year. You get ideas all the time. And when those ideas come up, I have somewhere to file them and put them away. So when that month approaches, I can pull out the bin and have those ideas. For August, we always do a self-portrait to start off the school year. So I always have that in here with an example for the children on how they're gonna do it. It looks like you're solving a paper problem here. How are you using the mobile bin organizer? I use it for my guided reading center. Each bin allows me to stay organized with my group. It holds journals, books, papers to practice on, book report papers, and cutouts. Here we are at the desk. Yes, the desk. This is a place that I struggle with to keep organized. Really? Papers are everywhere, and this Turning Your Work Organizer helps me to stay organized. Okay. I have labeled each bin that allows me to store my papers. To copy, I can grab this bin and go to the office. Yeah. Paperwork that needs to be filed, things that need to be graded, and resources that I might need throughout the day, all in one convenient place. Oh, very good. Lisa, thanks for showing us some great organizational ideas. Thanks for joining me, Ran. You know, with a little discipline and organization, you can solve the paper problem. All right. Be sure to like this video and post your comments. And subscribe to the Lakeshore Learning Channel to see more.